happening today, jury selection gets underway in the trial against the father of the Oxford school shooter who killed four of his classmates back in November of 2021. This is a highly unusual legal case where the father of the gunman is facing four counts of involuntary manslaughter. His wife just convicted of the same charges in her trial last month. News Nation's Kelsey Kernstein has been following this trial closely for us. Um, a lot of eyeballs. On, on this one, once and again. Really, quite frankly, Marky, there really should be. Uh, this is an unprecedented case where we are seeing the parents blamed for their son's actions. Uh, but getting away this week is uh, getting underway, that is. James Crumbly's trial and his defense team, if we look at it, they've already tried to get the trial moved to a different county. They tried to bring in jurors from a different county, but both those tax tactics didn't work, and the judge rejected those requests. A jury selection could be a bit unpredictable in this process. Some legal experts say that it could take several days to find a fair, unbiased jury. Uh, in Jennifer Crumbly's trial, the jury selection process lasted two days. But really important to point out here, on the day of the shooting, both James and Jennifer Crumbly were called to Oxford High School to pick up their son. This comes after a teacher saw him, their son, drawing disturbing pictures depicting a gun and a person being shot. But during that meeting, both parents refused to take their son home and failed to notify the school that they had recently bought their son a gun. James Crumley is charged with four counts of involuntary manslaughter. Uh, that is the exact same charges his wife faced in her trial. And get this, she was convicted on all four, four crimes last month. Uh, during her testimony, Jennifer suggested that it was up to her husband to keep the gun their son used in the shooting stored safely. Although the two trials are very similar in this case, a News Nation's legal analyst Sarah Azori says that there's one crucial difference that could be key to the case. A big difference here is that James Crumbly was not as involved in the events that occurred right before the shooting on the day of. Um, Jennifer was more involved in the dialogue with the school, but he bought the gun. Once jury selection is complete, Marky, it will, uh, the trial should take place the very next day. Yeah. Lots it's of a, eyes. It's an undertaking to find an impartial jury. I mean, especially when she's just convicted, she's pointed the finger multiple times from that witness stand at James. And everyone um, so we'll saw see. the wife's trial across the country and possibly even the world yeah. because it's an unprecedented case. Yeah. A lot of parents watching that one yeah. too. Kelsey, oh, thank you. Mm -hmm. Thanks for watching, everybody. Go to joinnn.com to find News Nation on your television provider. Also, don't forget to click that red subscribe button below to get more of News Nation's fact driven, unbiased coverage.